Ladies and gentlemen, here we are in the pit of the much talked about supercharged machine of DJ Don Johnson and the man from Japan, Takeshi Shigematsu. Talk. Great to see you, man. Every, everybody's talking about you. Oh, yeah? 602 last year in Valdosta. What are your thoughts here heading into this year of NHRA drag racing? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> that, that five second run, that first five. Is it on your mind? Does it mean anything to you? Oh yeah, it does mean to me a lot. Yeah, but uh, we wanna get down the track fast to pass, you know, not to smoke tire. Excellent, yep. excellent. Now we see a lot of guys are slow to go to this supercharger. You've stuck with it. You think this is the way to go in Nitro Harley for the future? I think so, yeah. It makes power. And the final question I have for you is, how are you so fearless? I've watched you hit the wall, break your handlebars. <laughs> Remember when you broke your handlebars many years ago and you stayed in the throttle? The many years ago, the handlebar broke was uh, before the fire up. So I knew it, I knew it, it's broken. But uh, the last year, the handlebar broke was uh, 800 feet. That's right. Probably uh, 220 miles per hour. Scary. <laughs> You're the man. We're all rooting for you to run that first five second run as preparations continue here. DJ turning the wrenches, all the experience. DJ, how you feeling heading into this season? Not too good right now. <laughs> we had a little problem, but we'll figure it out. Sorry to hear that. You know, so many people talking about you guys in this combination. They really believe this is the way to go. And I've heard a few say that you were on a 588 pass in Valdosta if all went well. Is that correct? That's what the incremental show. More like I think it was like a 585. Okay. One of the uh, inline bikes ran a 585, and Pac was a thousand quicker to a thousand feet when a handlebar broke. What's been the biggest challenge working with a supercharger? I don't know yet. I'm finding out now. There you go. Well, you're an innovator and a pioneer. Good luck to you guys. Keep an eye on them. Could this be the first ever five-second Nitro Harley?